Okay, so now I try to plug in the phone, my phone, Sony Xperia 1 Mark V, my phone, right here. This is the Sony Xperia 1 Mark V and I will try to connect it to a TV and have a desktop mode, desktop mode using the USB hub here. This USB hub is connected via HDMI HDMI to the TV Okay, we have HDMI connected to the TV TV says no signal so hopefully All these nuts went to the floor. The TV says no signal for HDMI. I think it's going to reach signal. Okay, so let's see. This is a bit difficult. I'll put like this. Use the power bank as a stand. The power bank is not plugged in. I could plug it in to keep the phone going for long longer, but for now, all I try, I plug it in. Oh, external device. There was something about external device connected. Okay, let's try again. External device connected, you can simultaneously output audio and video, I think. Okay. So we are... We are connected. Okay, so the phone is connected. Oh wow, have a whole menu here. There is a whole menu in there. So <clears throat> USB external output audio settings. Don't know, it detected liquids. I'm not sure, maybe I made a short by mistake. Output audio. Okay. Okay, let's try and hope I will see something. This is no AV, no HDMI. Oh, I see the phone, but it's it's a clone. Don't worry, I know a fix for this. It's a nice fix for this. So whenever I do something here. It replicates there. Problem is that I don't want to use it as a vertical mode. Okay, one small trick here. Developer options. <clears throat> and here, where is it? I will want to force desktop mode. Okay, I got it. So force desktop mode. I have to reboot the phone, so okay, let's do it. Let's do the restart. The force desktop mode in developer options will force the 
display on the secondary it will force the display on the secondary to, via the USB there is the Xperia starting ok we are getting some picture ok and the phone is on but it's not unlocked so I will unlock it entering the pin shows lock now it's unlocked wow <laughs> I even have some kind of a desktop background okay so now if I when I move here it doesn't change anything there for this I need to use a keyboard and mouse so a keyboard and mouse is what I have the phone has a separate screen so you can actually use them separately so I'll put plug in the receiver from the keyboard and mouse okay moving around on the phone if you see it but how do I get it on that screen that's weird yeah the problem is I can't get interaction with the secondary display so this is a bit not so great let's try power delivery See now it shows that it's charging should show it's charging ok I force it but no so I can move the laptop this the arrow of the mouse will not go further on the secondary display so maybe I could use it use it to show something or no okay I'll put it back even though it looks nice I can't use it so but I'll use it in landscape mode the mouse on the phone looks really interesting So I go to developer, type here, okay, it typed it, developer options. Maybe there is another setting here to make the display work better, like a dual screen. I don't know, I can't see it. It will not go to the secondary display. Okay. Don't know what happened there, nothing happened. I have to restart it again, I think. Okay. If I keep the phone in the landscape mode, when I use an app that is for landscape, I think it will work fine and it will be a mirror, a mirror of the display from the phone to the TV with the input from the keyboard and the mouse. So this is pretty, pretty good. You can use the keyboard from bed. Okay, so we're back on the phone is on and nothing on the TV. Okay, one small unplug. Okay, and we're back to we're back to the beginning, but I can switch this. Yeah, 
day loop. Interesting, I like them. 3000 Kelvin. Look how they turn off. And one. Off. Okay, let's try now. Force desktop mode. Reboot now. So it's gonna restart again and we will see. Okay, it's working and here we have the normal screen of the phone and there is the desktop mode from the developer options for the desktop mode. We will see now if the actual Windows key will start the menu there. Let's see now. It only starts the menu there on the phone. So this, ah, but the mouse, ah, okay, I have the mouse now on the second display. And when it goes up, I don't know where it goes. It doesn't show on the, be on the screen anymore. Okay. Okay, I can start it there. So we have the phone there. For this one mode is a bit, a bit finicky. I will show you on Samsung Galaxy X23 Ultra, where you have the DEX display, separate desktop than your phone, and that would be that would be very that would be very nice on the Samsung S23 Ultra, and I will show you in a future video, which is gonna be probably soon, really soon. So. Check, check that video when it shows up. Thanks for watching. Xperia can work on desktop mode. For desktop mode doesn't really work. I don't know what's this. Android 14, this one. But it will work if the video, the display is cloned and you turn the phone around. Thanks for watching.